We all hope to find that one special person to love and that we hope to be loved by that special person for all time. Family, friends, we have been invited here today to share with Alyssa and Michael a very special moment in their lives. So you are my one and only. Today is our special day. I am beyond excited to be your partner in life. I promise you, you won't face this world alone. You have become my lover, my companion, my best friend. I promise to care for you and protect you. I will be there to comfort you and encourage you throughout life. I promise to be there with you for all eternity. You hold the key to my heart. I cannot wait to take life on with you as my wife. Mike and Alyssa, I just asked three things of you. One, always, always remember to love yourself. Two, always remember to love family. You have so much family here and they love you. And always remember to love each other and you'll have the best relationship in the world. I am so grateful that you were born before me. I came into the world and you were already here. I think any shoes that the eldest sibling is expected to fill, you've filled them and then some. It's corny, but I think it's true. Your soccer days are a perfect example of who you are at your core. Brave, hardworking, always showing up, and always able to save the day. I've always considered Mike the brother I never had. It's not often you can say two of your lifetime friends have gotten married. That's something that I'll always cherish. Mike, now you do me a favor. Remember to always put Alyssa first. And Alyssa, always love Mike no matter how many headaches he may give you. You are my best friend, my lover, and partner in life. I am proud to take you as my husband. You were there when I faced the greatest challenges. I cannot imagine my life without you in it. You've always been a constant for me throughout my life, and I value our friendship that brought us here today. By definition, love is the quality or feeling of a strong and constant affection and dedication to one another. As we sit here today in witness of this beautiful union between Michael and Alyssa, we have some things to learn from the two of them, who over the years have shown us and lived out exactly what the definition of love is, keeping that strong, constant affection and dedication to each other. Alyssa and Michael, you are living proof that love is alive and well in this crazy world and that love will always prevail in the end. These are the hands that are holding yours on your wedding day as you promise to love each other today, tomorrow, and forever. These are the hands that will work alongside yours as together you build your future as you now travel along your journey of marriage and love for each other, I ask you to remember the message of the rose. Give each other a rose at very regular intervals in your future life, so as to remind you and each other that the journey is truly worth it. At the end, the glory, the beauty, and the elegance is well worth the bumps and the spikes along the way. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride.
Alyssa. Thank you for showing me what hard work, dedication, trust, and compassion means. Thanks for loving Mike unconditionally because now I not only have a sister in you, but you have provided me the opportunity to also gain a brother. The most important thing to remember in a marriage is to continually do more connecting than correcting. Communicate effectively, be each other's emotional support, spend quality time together, and most importantly, never stop falling in love with each other over and over again. I love you both dearly. Cheers.